Hey everyone, welcome back to the Awesomer channel. I'm sure you noticed from the quick preview, but we'll be making a Play-Doh sandwich and a cola today. So the first thing you have to do is roll out some brown Play-Doh and then make a cylinder-like shape. Once you get that, you want to flatten the sides and the top to make it a bread-like shape. Alright, we have one side of our sandwich roll right here. Now let's add some details to this. Since this is the top bread, we'll add the score marks. Give me a minute. Now let's peel the marks out and clean them up a bit. This will only take a second. Perfect! We made the top bread, now let's make the bottom bread. Let's make the same shape as before. Now let's use this roller to flatten it out. Now let's shape this a little bit. Make sure the top matches the bottom. Excellent! We just finished making our bread. Now we have to make the ingredients for our sandwich. Start by rolling out some green Play-Doh. Now let's use this circle cutter. Now let's wrinkle the edges. And then fold it. Perfect! We made a piece of lettuce. Now let's do the same for the rest of these green circles. It almost feels like we're making dumplings. But all these pieces don't need to look identical, so feel free to make them however you like. There we go! We have all of our lettuce pieces. Now let's roll out some red Play-Doh. Let's make some more circles. Okay, we have three red circles. Now let's use a heart stamper. Do you know what we're making? If you guessed tomato slices, you're correct. These are the prettiest tomato slices. Now let's roll out some yellow Play-Doh. This time we'll use a tool to make square shapes, and then we'll use a circle cutter to add details. Check it out! We made three slices of Swiss cheese. Okay, now let's roll out some purple Play-Doh. Now let's use this giant circle cutter. Now we'll use a smaller cutter. Grab the outer rings, and we have a couple of red onion slices. Now let's reuse all the extra Play-Doh to make some more. Give me a minute. Awesome! Now we have a handful of red onion slices. Alright, now let's roll out some pink Play-Doh. We'll use the circle cutter again. Let's make a couple more. Awesome! And we don't need to do anything with these because they already look like ham slices. Now let's roll out some red Play-Doh. Use the large circle cutter. 
and we don't have to do anything with these either because we just made pepperoni slices. All right, we made all of our ingredients. Now let's assemble our Play-Doh sandwich. Start with the pepperoni slices. Now let's add the ham slices on top, but make sure they're folded like this. Now let's add the lettuce. Now the tomato slices. Now let's add the onions. Now let's add the cheese. Put the bread on top. Perfect! Here's a closer look at our Play-Doh sandwich. This sandwich could feed at least four people. Now, if you were to eat this entire sandwich by yourself, you need something to wash it down with, so let's make a Play-Doh soda. Alright, let's roll out this dark brown Play-Doh. Now let's use the roller handle to make the bottle neck. Now let's touch this up a bit. Perfect! Now let's use the roller handle again to make the bottle shape. Now you want to make sure this bottom part is flat. Give me a minute. Alright, now let's slice the top a bit. Okay, we cut the top part off because we need to make the bottle cap. But before we do that, let's make the design on the bottom. Give me a minute. There we go. Make sure our bottle stands perfectly still. Now let's use some red Play-Doh to make our cap. Use your fingers to flatten the cap. Now let's put the cap on top of the bottle. And use a tool to make lines to seal the bottle. Perfect! We just sealed our soda in the bottle. Now let's make the label. Roll out some red Play-Doh. Now let's make a rectangular shape. All right, now let's roll out some white Play-Doh. We'll use a slicer to make really thin lines. Now we'll use these thin lines to spell out cola. Sit back and relax while I do this part. C-O-L-A. Perfect! We made our cola label. Now let's wrap it around the bottle. Perfect! Now we can wash our sandwich down with an ice cold soda. Let's slice this sandwich in half. Check it out! With Play-Doh, we made a really pretty sandwich and an awesome cola bottle. Hope these instructions were easy to follow. I'm sure you guys did better than us. Well, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to click that subscribe button for more awesome videos. See ya!